straight up. Oh my, my just go in the bin, dude. What's commuter? A new hack. I'm getting back to playing new stuff. Let's have a look. What's Mega BC Triple Three done? What's their other submission? Super Toshio World. I've never seen that one. That came out uh, mid last year. But for now, look, it's commuter. Came out uh, super recently, December, 13 exit intermediate. It's a short little shell hack with short little levels. Towards the beginner side, but overall intermediate. Uh, <laughs> there's a weird freeze on the title screen. Don't do it. Each level has a secret exit that leads to a switch palace. There are 13 exits, but each level has a secret. All right. Uh, I'm sure this will make sense. Anyway, got a five with one rating from Neuromancer. Says very fun. Title screen is fine. Select an overworld to save, which is great. This looks like a shell hack with uh, glass 1F zeros. Maybe. Unless they're sprite solids. I don't know. You know what? It doesn't matter. Uh, sprite killers and switch palacey things. You got a double bonker there. Uh, there's, a, oh, there's a line there. Yeah. You got some very intense backgrounds. Look, look, it looks like the screenshots are telling me that it's a shell level. What the hell is this? I don't know what that sprite is. It'll probably make sense at some point. Let's jump in. Let's have a look at commuter. If we were commuting today. Let's uh, do this thing. The week is over. It's time to go home. Ah, thus we commute. Uh, the roadhouse. Uh, L L R H, left, left, right, and then H. You can go in the chimney thing. One F zero. Sprite killer. Mario killer. What if we touch the? We can't touch. Uh. Spin and jump seems good. Do thing with shell. Love it. Start select as exit level. Select no world to save, and thus concludes your comprehensive tutorial on how to play the game. The overworld is perfectly fine. Highland. Oh, wait, there's ground down there? Oh, we already got a problem. Gotta, like, push into it and let go of jump, I guess. Yeah, look, they tried with the coin. It wasn't exactly what I do. So that's fine. We cut some jump there and then maybe. Bruh. Just let him go. I, I find it hard enough to do everything, let alone manage ads. There's a pipe there. Don't care. No. There we go. It was a short section. It was perfectly fine. It was pretty chill. It's a good start. It sets an expectation that you're going to do a lot of bumps and not touch the ground. But apparently there's secret exits in every level. I forgot about that. So maybe it's the pipe right at the end. I don't know if I spotted anything else apart from like, can't really go left at the start. I mean, I wasn't looking, but hey. in hole. There we go. Don't know if there's a checkpoint there. I would I would super hope there was a checkpoint there. Okay, we've got the county line. It's sort of a yellowish switch palace. Disco. Alright, disco where there's a lot of speed on the shell. Yep, seems good. Maybe that would be enough, but then I'm not a big fan of the normal stuff anyway. Alright, there we go. It's all mid airs. No, 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 no. It's a runoff. Oh, oh no, 
Oh, it's a checkpoint. Love to see that. Good job. Oh, GG Yellow Switch. Where'd Mario go? He's gone. Uh, what do we got? We got the Grizzly Bay. What if the bay was a grizzly one? It would be like this. Oh, the wait, wait, what? Is a shell jump, anyone? Alright, alright. Damn, dude, it's not a good start if you can't do a shell jump, a sanding shell jump, huh? Spin, jump. Or if you could jump and then do that. And wait, wait, what was that over there? Spider secret. Yeah, there was a band called Bad Brains, it's true. But what if they were called Brad Brains? <laughs> Your jaw drops at times? Nah, you play a couple of shell levels, you get the... Yeah, you can read them. Oops. Ah, uh, yeah, two tile pipe. You have to jump a bit to the right. What the hell is this? Are those solid? They are solid, okay. My confusion stems from the fact that those, uh, those column things are typically ledges, so they shouldn't be solid from below. But hey, you know, it's, I'm glad that they were, otherwise I have no idea what that move was. Shell Refinery, we got the blue switch. Good song. I, I approve of this song. You don't think you've only heard of it? No, this is uh, Linda's World. It's, uh, it's, uh, uh, what's his name? Radix. Uh, Alright, just stay there. Hope uh, and Niv feels uh, more educated now. Am I slow? One, two, three. Get the thing. All right, all right, all right. Yeah, just actually land on the things. It's so simple. One, two, three, four. And in an up pipe. It's simple. <laughs> yeah, it is. I'm showing you how simple it is. Uh, numbers. Alright. Dave, there's a lot of really good Kaizo players out there. And they'll make me look like a fool. Alright? But I appreciate the, that you're very enthusiastic about me playing a, a shell hack. Mineta? Mineta International? Sure. Cheers. Thank you. Thank you. You just started yumping? Yeah, well, don't stop. Uh, what are we doing? Just a shell jump, hit your head? Disco shell. Uh, and then hit this. And hit that. I hit it at the wrong time, actually. Let me down. All right, we should swing it out left, maybe. All right. But I had to wait. I had to hit it again somehow. Oh wait, there's an on-off here. Ooh. still have no idea if there are checkpoints at the ends so we're gonna have to go back and maybe pay more attention this time like that line guide there is super sus right why would there be a vertical line guide because you don't hit the on off 
Ah, that's why. Okay, okay, damn. Please checkpoint me. Oh my god, yay. Key in the hole. Alright. Alright, secret exit's probably way easier than normal exit. So, now we got Lexington Reservoir. The red switch. In which we immediately throw it back. Wait, I've got to hit that thing at the top. Alright, watch your head. I think, uh, I think I'm struggling a bit with the aesthetics in this level. I think some foreground stuff is a bit too dark for my tastes. I don't know why they're not just like normal, um, uh, like normal glass blocks. I guess they broke pallet 4 or something. Big shell jump, right? Something went wrong. The shell is coming along for the ride this time. There it is. Bruh. Think fast. Don't think fast, actually. It's just a bare double. Oh my god. <laughs> Damn. Thanks for the checkpoint, though. Apparently I've got some, uh, some practice to do. GG Red Switch! Alright. Uh, whoever made this one was Mega BC333. Very talented. Alright, Summit Woods. Oh. Wait, there's ground at the start? <laughs> wait. Is, is this a pipe? Oh my god. <laughs> it's a portrait for somebody. <laughs> Damn. That's a hard one to find. You've got to be so stupid. Uh, that you just like stay still at the start. Uh huh. Good job. Oh, there's another pipe there too. Like this thing, what's this? What's that do? It was the secret exit, right? Hmm. All right. I guess we're doing the secret exit first because I spotted it. Okay, we finally got the fourth switch palace. It's Glenhaven, and it's green. And this screen wrap. Uh oh. Oh. Uh. <laughs> and then what are these? This is. Yep. You do that, and then you go over here, and you throw it through, and then you jump over. All right. All right. To be like really good at it. We played a decent amount. Kick it through and bounce. Oh my god, that's exactly what you do. This is actually hard. I mean, I don't think the moves are hard. It's just uh, remembering where to go and how to deal with Mario being all over the place. So, bonk there, upper pipe. And in this one, you have to do that. All right, well, there you go. One for four nump. But one for four yumps, three for four numps. GG green switch. So now we have to actually play the level, Summit Woods, which was shell jump to the right at the start. Up, oh, jump. Ah, oh, there's a thing here. Four. Two, one. Mm. I just had to get in there. There, and just run left. 
Uh, there. Little spin. Little less spin you got. Wow. <laughs> Thank you for the check. Love to see checkpoints like that. Ooh, what's under here? <gasps> Nothing! Oh, dude. I was so curious. I wanted to check it out. All right. All right. That's fair. Why don't we just land on it anyway, just for fun? Got him. Yeah. I was thinking to myself, like, what is a what's a good troll and what's not a good troll? I wouldn't want to punish curiosity because I think uh, I don't know if that's good. Because if you if you're the sort of person that puts like secrets or portrait rooms or things like that, if you punish someone for being curious, they're not going to go looking for those kinds of things. Having said that, that one is fine. Like, that's such a short section. You can have a little fun like that. I know, yeah, ZX, that's exactly why I was thinking about it. Like, I've made mistakes. I haven't I haven't got a consistent rule. That's why I've not been a trolley person. Because I just, I don't know, like, what is good and what is bad. Anyway, East Cliff. What are we doing on the East Cliff? Uh, believe it or not, shell jumps. Ah, pink goombas. That was the weird sprite that I saw in one of the screenshots. Oh, there's a little bit of lag right there. Beanie. Welcome in. Uh, something went wrong there. like that, that, and then it's going to line up somewhere, and then we're going to do some one-tile kind of uh, shell bump and jumps. Oh. Uh, you got to land on the platform first, or it's still going to be that high. In there as well. all kind of working dude all right nice hopefully we don't need more iframes on this side <gasps> we need some oh, you son of a gun you did need iframes and just like straight up oh my I, just go in the bin dude it looks really nice can I get in the next pipe but no, because P-Speed kicks in. It's like, uh, you need to jump. Oh, hang on a second. P-Speed just kicked in a second before you're about to jump. And now you overshoot it. Let's see if we can fail it again in the same way. Ugh. Alright, caught it just as PSP kicked in. Oh my god, please be a checkpoint. Oh, thank you. No way I was going to figure that out. Oh, a mushroom? I don't think I'm supposed to... Oh yeah, it's just a switch check section. Alright. Muta by Mega BC Triple Three. There's no, that is not the end. That was not 13 exits. One, two, three. I guess it, you know what, actually? I think it is. I think that was all 13 exits. Holy crap. I was a bit concerned loading up an intermediate shell hack, but you know what? Short sections. It makes it like way more bearable. And to be fair, I was starting to feel it a little bit in my right hand, all the like jump holding and stuff. Not that it was a bad time, but I just, I really shy away from shell stuff because it is really taxing on the hands. Uh, so this is, believe it or not, this is hack nut 460. Yeah, 460, unless I like lost count at some point. We did it, we made it. 460, so I've done, how many hacks have I played this year then? It's like uh, 165. You drive your car for bridge if you play that many hacks? Yeah, look. It does take its toll. Let's do a reset. We'll just double check that we've managed to acquire all the 13 exits available. And it's true. That's the whole 13. It was commuter, 
Mega BC triple three. It was good. I think that was a fun shell hack. If you like doing back bumps and stuff like that, I like to bump shells off one of zeros, it'll it's it's kind of your thing probably. You might like this one. Sections are short. It's uh, I think they were right when they said that it was uh, beginner side of shell hacks, but overall intermediate. I think that seems about right. <laughs>